Alright, so last video, um, I showed you how to pin one of these guys. Now today I'm gonna pin this beautiful little thing. These little things are called salt marsh mobs. They're part of the Arabidae family in Tiger and Tootsock mods. They don't actually go to salt marshes, They're f though they are found in salt marshes. But, why they're actually called that is their host plant is actually a type of grass called the salt marsh grass. And I'm gonna pin one. They come in two color variations. One, I got right here with white hind wings. And then the other one, the hind wings are actually orange. Everything else about them is the same, though. And just like tiger stripes, the spot pattern is different within every individual. Alright, so first we got to put the pin through the thorax just like that. Right through the middle. Just like that. Now pick your little notch. I'm going to go with this one since it's the easiest. It's nice and snug. Make sure the wings are nice and flush with this thing, whatever it is. And then now you can take pins. I would do small pins to put the least amount of damage to the wings and then go all the way up just like that that exact angle same with the hind wing the hind wing kind of got loose so I have to Fix that. What you do if this happens. What actually happened. Moths. Not butterflies. They have. A little hook. Underneath the hind wing. That hooks on to the forewing. So in flight. The forewing stays connected to the hind wing and then that can snap easily while pinning to fix that you can just do that you can move the hind wing up first and then take the hind wing lift it up make sure the bottom half flaps out and then you're good to go now all you need to do is take a glass slide Pop it right on there. And then, now, you can replicate it on the other side. There, just like that. That was a pretty good transition there, huh? Now you can get some bigger pins, and then do whatever you want with them. This is a female moth, so... I'm going to have to prop up the abdomen so it doesn't sag because they are pretty fat and they are really heavy and floppy. There we go. All better. Now all you need to do is put the glass slide over on the other side and boom, you're done. And uh, also, I pinned this big boy, but I didn't film him. What I did was, um, I already have a bunch of them spread with the wings open, but this one I wanted to do it a little different. I want to put it in its resting position, because why not? Um, yeah. Wings back slightly. Slight curve on the abdomen. Curd, um, fold, folded up antennas, and, uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, and if you did, you're sure gonna like the next one, because I got some cool, cool bugs coming in the mail.